The Sheltonham School District is investigating how a five-year-old boy got dropped off at the wrong bus stop on his second day of school. Well, I spoke with the little boy's parents about their frenzied search to find him. Daddy was scared. Were you scared? Yes. Five-year-old Cameron Nelson is still frightened after his parents say he was dropped off at the wrong bus stop on his second day of school. It was his first day riding the school bus. And I'm thinking, you know, my son is next to come off. I kept looking, and once I saw Cameron didn't get off, my heart, it just dropped. Shaquise Davenport says at the end of the school day, she returned to Wagner Way and John Russell Circle in the Linwood Gardens complex to pick up her son. He never stepped off the bus, so her husband began the frantic search to find him. I was running for maybe approximately about half a mile, um, trying to see where my son was. By then, neighbors had joined the search of the sprawling complex. A few blocks away, 10 to 15 minutes later, Isaiah spotted his son, shaken but safe. Finally saw a kid with a black shirt and red shorts. That was I knew that was my son. Um, he was with two strangers who would look like they got out of their car, um, and I just. I just broke down. I was crying about him. You were crying and about him? Daddy was crying. Those moments, they felt like forever. And I was thinking, I wasn't going to see my son anymore. I was thinking, you know, that was it. Like, cause she couldn't tell me. She couldn't tell me where specifically she dropped him off at. She couldn't tell me she wasn't even aware that he was on that bus. Cameron's parents want answers as to how this could have happened. They want Sheltonham school officials to hold the transportation company accountable and account for every child in their care. What I want is to at least have a reevaluation of something site wide, school wide. Well, the Sheltonham School District Superintendent did send us this statement in reference to the incident. It reads in part, quote, upon learning of this most unfortunate incident, our team responded immediately by opening an investigation with our bus contractor, Sheltonham Transportation. We are also reviewing protocols and policies with our transportation partners to identify where updates might be warranted.